up? Guys, how are you? It's Frasier. I really shouldn't have just done that intro with my voice. I don't know why I felt like shouting. But you know what I have to show you? I have to show you how my car nearly, my car just nearly got absolutely fucked. So right now in England, it is like one of the windiest days in forever. And you guys see this basketball hoop over here. This basketball hoop over here fell over, but I fixed it and laid it across that way. My car was parked here next to my stepdad's car. It's now down there, nice and safe. It was parked here. The basketball hoop was facing up, facing this way. And I came back home after driving my car to the bakery to get my breakfast. And this basketball hoop is laying here across the exact same spot my car was. So if I didn't get hungry for a sausage roll or anything, my car right now would be absolutely fucked and I'll be so pissed off and I probably wouldn't be making this vlog. Look guys, I'll show you around the side of my actual car now. My brother on my birthday accidentally reversed into the side of my car. Can you guys see this huge dent? It has to be fixed with a new door and it's gonna cost 2,000 pounds, which is horrible. But you know what? I'm just lucky that thing didn't land on my car. Otherwise, right now, I'd be jumping off the roof of this house. So I hope that audio quality outside then was okay because of the amount of wind. I realized how loud I was shouting. One of my next door neighbors like came around and was just looking at me vlog when I was pointing at the basketball hoop. And you guys couldn't see him, but I would see him over there. I was like, oh yeah. Yeah, this must look so weird. But what I want to show you guys today is a very new cool addition to my room. This, this little indoor basketball hoop, which my friends and I have been trying so much to do crazy trick shots with. And honestly, I have spent hours, hours doing trick shots. Um, if you can't tell, I'm kind of looking for the ball because it's a little bit lost. Um, I really can't find the ball. I might have to go into my town and buy a new one. So I found it. Oh, there we go. A bounce shot. I just hit a bounce shot into it. Where did the ball go? I've lost the ball now. I just hit a bounce trick shot in there. Look, I'm going to go to the other side of the room. So I'm going to hit a long shot while looking at the camera. Haha, <laughs> no way. Do you know how fun it is having a basketball hoop in your bedroom? I just literally sit here for hours. Like, when I'm editing, when I'm finished doing a video, I'll just be like, oh, you know, like, I'm done editing. Bam, and I missed that shot, but the, the bounce shot is fun. You know what? It's really annoying only having one ball. So I think I might have to quickly make a trip to the shop and get a couple more. I found some balls that hopefully will work from my local sports shop. But now I'm going to go find my friends and uh, have some lunch with them because every single lunch I always have lunch with my friends is really good because I'm a YouTuber and I always stay at home alone all the time. So seeing people in the day is actually fun. Okay, so I'm going to go for the furthest possible shot in my room. I am literally sitting in the corner. So I'm in the furthest away place and then I'm going to lie down so I'm even further away and hit the furthest possible shot I can in my bedroom into the basketball hoop. Oh, missed. Wow, holy shit. That literally came and bounced right back to me. Oh, so close. Oh, there we go. I did it from the furthest possible away spot. I did it. All right, who says I can't get two goes in a row? Okay. Oh my God, this is it. No! I was so close to two! I'm gonna go for something so hard now. I'm gonna try and over backwards. Oh my god, I hit my lamp. I hit my lamp. Alright, let's try that again. Alright, I need to get used to where to throw it. That was Jesus telling me have another go. I don't believe in Jesus. Did I just hit the light switch? I think you should. Did I just hit the fucking light switch? Wait. No, no, it's in like. Oh, I hit the what? fucking light switch. What? I turned the light off. Ryan just turned the light off. What? Ryan. I ghosted or something, man. What the fuck? That tripped me out too. What? Ryan made the light switch, so he la How did you turn it off? With the ball. I Sorry, no, but the ball like, because the light switch is on. That's mental. Mate, That's that sick. Was so weird. That's sick. <laughs> Guys, so you know this Storm Doris thing? I think it has fucked up our garden. Jarvis, what was it? 
Yeah, so basically I went out with the dogs and I just saw at the back, the whole fence is like falling over. What? Apparently our whole fence has fallen over in our garden. Does our mum know? No, I don't know. You don't know? Okay, let me go see. Oh my god, I can see the... Can what? See the what the hell? No way. That's fucked. Does the next door neighbours know? Uh, Have you literally just found this out? Yeah, I've literally Oh my god. No fucking way, our garden's ruined. That's not even our garden over there. Guys, what the fuck? Storm Doris has actually fucked up our house. Look at this shit. I can't believe the storm did this. What? What? Uh, Holy fuck, how windy is it? Yeah, I know. It is so windy and I've got you guys on a tripod. A massive, a really massive long tripod. Do you not know about this? No, I knew about the storm, but I didn't know about this. Look, like, I swear that was even taller. Yeah, same. That's what I thought. Yeah, 100% yeah, was taller. It's gone into the ground. Right? Yeah, that's what I mean. I think it's gone down into the ground. That is crazy. This storm has actually ruined our house. Just watching his new video, and I just want to give him a shout out and just tell him that I fucking love I bought the new Yeezys, okay? I literally just bought these ones over here. The Oreo, you guys know these ones, the Oreo ones. I, I just bought those. I have these ones, I've had these ones for ages. These are my favorite ones, you know, the pirate black ones. Uh, I've got these, which are NMDs, they're Adidas as well. Actually, everything's Adidas. I don't have any other pairs of NMDs other than those. Um, those are just my other friends, Ryan shoes. But it was kind of an accident how I bought these. Like, it's not an accident, I, I did it on purpose, but I was kind of drunk, like, you know, you guys know in England, I've just turned 21, and obviously the drinking age in England is 18, before people are like, well, you're drinking before you're 21, no, in, in England, you drink when you're 18 years old, if you want to, you can go out clubbing and stuff, and my friends and I were celebrating, was it mine, or his 21st birthday, I don't even know, there's been, like, we're all turning 21 this year, so we've all been celebrating 21st birthdays, and I was on the way to a club, and <laughs> I was like, I really want these Yeezys. And then my friends were like, yeah, they're pretty sick and that. Um, and then I said, you know that sound my phone makes when I buy something on Apple Pay? It goes, ba ding. <laughs> and I was like, yeah. and they were like, yeah. And I was like, listen to this. Ba ding. <laughs> then they were like, Frasier, what did you just do? And I was like, I just bought the new Yeezys. And now, now they're here. And now I have them. And I really do like them. They're different to the other ones. I'll show you what I mean. So for anyone here who likes shoes, these are my three pairs of Yeezys that I have. Uh, I don't have any more. These are my three. So for this one, this has the back strip. This has the back strap thing, but this one doesn't, the Oreo. The Oreo one, his, the, the back like the back heel bit goes all the way up and it's like straight. But on this one, I don't know if it's the way my shoes were like folded or something or the way the design is. I'm pretty sure it's the design because it's the same on my other one. The back bit like comes out a bit and I really like that. It also has the back strap bit. It comes out a bit at the back. And it's got the Supplier 350. And they are so comfy. Like Yeezys, if you don't, if you've never worn Yeezys, I know they're a lot of money and they're not worth the money. I'm not saying they're worth the money. Um, you know, it's more about the height, more about what the shoe, you know, the brand, everything like that. We all know that. But the comfiness of Yeezy, regardless of the price, regardless of how overhyped they are, the comfiness of these shoes, they are 100% the comfiest shoe I own. I don't own a pair of shoes. I don't own. I don't own a pair of shoes that are comfier. Jarvis, where are you going? Where are you going? You're coming back? Okay, sick. I thought you were going to leave me, Jarvis, and not say goodbye. Don't do that, Jarvis. Bye. Bye. That's Jarvis. I thought you were going to leave. Um. But yeah, what I need to do now is uh, probably go to the dentist and pay the dentist. Look, let me show you the bill for the dentist. I think I can show you that. So you may or may not know this, but I'm going to try and show you guys. One of my teeth in here, did you guys know that I actually don't have a tooth? It got taken out and ripped. Ah, uh, can you see? It's kind of like healed up and, and sealed a bit now because the teeth have got closer. But one of my back teeth, the main one, the one behind the wisdom tooth, got ripped out because my wisdom tooth came and crushed it. And yesterday, I went to the dentist. It's my first time going since I'm not on NHS. And what that is for Americans is pretty much when I'm 18 and in school. Like, the dentist is free. So, I went to the dentist and they were like, yeah, Fraser, you know, obviously you're working now. Uh, you're making money. You're not at, the, you know, at school. You can pay for the dentist now. You're an adult. I'm 21. So, I was like... Okay, I've never paid for the dentist before. What is the sort of price? And they gave me this. A hundred and sixty pound bill. 
Look, it costs £78 for me to get a filling, £42 for me to get a filling, because of some stuff going on, I had to get an appointment, like, straight away, because I want to get my teeth checked, and that cost extra money, then there's money for disposables, there's money for radiographs, I had to pay to get my, my mouth x-rayed, I'm just 21 and I'm an adult now, and I have these bills and things that I don't want to, and I'm not going to pay, and I don't want to do it, Ugh. okay, let's go to school, I'm taking Jarvis to school. Guys, I always pick Jarvis up from school, but today, I'm taking him to school. This is sick. Bye, Jarvis. Enjoy school. See you later. Bye-bye. Let's go home. So, in this vlog already, I have already shown you guys the side of my car that my brother Chandler accidentally did. But today, somebody else, somebody also accidentally reversed into the back of my car. And look. I'm not sure if you guys can see, but there is a dent here, and it like goes kind of here too. It's really, really small, and luckily the back bit of my car here, this is plastic, this is metal. Can you hear the difference? This is plastic. So, what Chana and I, my brother Chana, who actually studies like motoring in college, luckily Chana's like a mechanic pretty much, so he can help me out, and uh, can you see me? You can't see me. Can you see me now? There we go. So Chan's gonna help me out. Um, we're gonna pour boiling water on it. Uh, we've been looking up reading these life hacks. So we're gonna pour boiling water on the back of the car and then get it like hot and then Chana's gonna go behind and literally push and the dent should just push out. I went to a garage and some guy, some mechanic was like, oh yeah, I'm pretty sure uh, this is gonna cost a lot of money to be fixed. Oh no, he was like, I was like, so I was like, oh, can I um, fix it easily with like all hot water and stuff? He was like, no, 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 no way. So that guy, that steamy guy is obviously trying to get some money out of me and we don't want to do that. But we're going to see if I have to do that because the sensors in the back of my car still work perfectly. And Chandler is just boiling up the water to do to the car. Okay, it's getting really steamy. It is boiling water. Yeah. How, can you get your hand under there from here? It's literally straight under. Oh, okay. Sick. Okay. Man, that should work. That's like a lot of hot water. So, just do this quick. Oh my god, look, it's actually moulding it a bit. Look, you can see it moulding it. Holy fuck, Wait, do, you, do you have to just hold it? Holy shit. Well, it's worked a tiny bit. What China's gonna do is do it lots more times and just slowly, like, mould it. So now it's gonna go back to being, like, hot, and he's gonna slowly get it. So China's gonna let it cool down and let it set into the position that he put it in, and then he's gonna heat it up again with some more water and keep pushing it out and keep gradually fixing the back of my car. Is that Trey? <laughs> Fuck, guys. <laughs> Man. I think we just saw Trey. <laughs> <laughs> How was that working? That was fucking weird. Look, guys. I was just playing that through the magic speaker that makes anything into a speaker. 